We do this by keeping the runner in the dry phase, making sure that we're recruiting more muscle tissue at the same time that he's sprinting. Using the data that's coming in real time, we get the user past what would be normal mental blockage and force the person to compete against himself. This is the easiest and fastest way that we know right now to get a user to near maximum heart rate. And by doing this, we'll peak the metabolism and force the body to get more efficient. And how this happens is by increasing the volume of the mitochondrion, therefore allowing the interface between the bloodstream and we're becoming more efficient. This way, reaction time increases, speed increases, but also the ability to recover after max effort also increases.